Alright, I got a new project. I'm walking out to the backyard here. Yeah, she's not much to look at right now. 1984 ATC 200S. Yes, I'm sorry. Suspension is blown out, literally. I have the headlight guard. I took it off to uh, play with the wiring a little bit. It has a twist throttle on it. It's kind of weird to put on a utility truck, but whatever. Incorrect seat. Way incorrect gas tank. Uh, I do have the rear rack for it. It's got the trailer hitch. It's got the all original exhaust on it. And I need the recoil starter. It's missing. It does have high, low, and reverse, all of which work. Cracked front fender. I have a 200 ES frame, so I'm just going to swap the whole front end onto it. Let me uh, plug it in. I'll show you how it runs. It does smoke a little bit, too. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, light does work. High and low beam. This is the front rack, which is cool. And the electric start works. Let me give a little gas. This is my awesome gas tank. I bought it. I bought it not running. The battery even had still a little bit of a charge in it when I got it. So it's the air box and all. She's really raw, but not that bad. At least it runs and all. Smokes a little bit. Light works for neutral. It also looks like it has a, a factory spotlight hookup. So I'm going to have to inquire about that a little bit. So, yeah, there she is. Fired up again. Just a replay of Star Wars. Oh, they're cool. I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyway, <laughs> there it is. And the tires actually do hold there too. Cool. Oh, and all the uh, brake levers are frozen. Dude had it sitting outside for a year. I drained the old gas out of the car, put new gas in after a lot of fuss. She finally fired up. Now she seems like she's running better. So. Keep going, I might swap the forks this weekend and make it completely runnable, other than the gas tank. Later.